Hi guys, in this tutorial we will see how to find and replace a string using a Perl script. So let's start our code. Now I am using a symbol called dollar which is used to declare a variable in Perl. So I am declaring, declaring a variable called file name. And in this file name I am storing an argument variable of array 0. The argument variable of array 0 is used to source an input file when I am used when I am running a Perl script. I will show you when I am running the Perl script after the completion of the code. Now since we are handling files here, I am using a file operation called open. Open is a keyword which is used to open a file and store the content of a file in a special variable. So this is a variable where I will store the content of an input file and I will set the direction of the input file as an input. So the less than symbol is nothing but it stores the whatever the file we define in this third argument the file name. into the file variable so here it will open a file called file here and it is set as an input file and this input file is nothing but the file name which we source as an input now i am declaring a array by using a keyword my the array name is lines here I am storing a whatever file which is opened here I am storing in this array variable. Now since I opened the file here there should be a close file. Close is a keyword command which is used to close a file. So here what happens is I opened a file here and setting the direction as an input file. I am storing the, all the content of the file in, into a variable called lines and I am closing the file. Now in order to manipulate this file, I need to open a conditional statement here. I am using it for each as a condition statement. And open the and open the file here by using at lines command. So here what happens is for each at lines means at whenever the at lines is called here, it will store the file operand in this conditional statement means it opens the file whenever it opens the file in background it creates a special variable called dollar underscore here the variable dollar underscore is a special variable is a keyword which stores all the content in your file in dollar underscore variable so whenever the file is stored in dollar underscore variable it is ready to manipulate now in order to replace a string, I am using a command here. Search the whatever string you want. Hi. I want to replace with hello. I want to search uh, hi in entire text file. So I am giving as a G as a global. So it will search in the entire file. Now I am closing the bracket here. Now again, since I want to open the file and change the content in the file and replace the same file, I am again opening the file here and creating a same variable file and setting that file as an output now. In the same declaring variable as file name. Now, when I declare as a 
output it creates a file name so whatever dollar underscore file name has in variable it creates a file so that file will be empty now at that time the for each loop ends so whatever the content which is modified will be saved in at lines variable so i want to pin print the at lines as the output so print the lines variable in file so whatever the content in at lines will be saved in file variable now i am closing the file so let's run our code so i have a sample.txt file which has hi buddy this is a sample text message now i want to replace hi with hello so argument variable is nothing but the sample.txt i am sourcing this one as input you see here for this is the script which is which is written by us just now now sample.txt now the sample.txt is nothing but argument variable since it is defined as array of zero because it, there is only one sample.txt which we have given as input so let's execute this one so if we go to our sample.txt so hi will be changed to hello now reload the selector yeah hi is changed as hello so by this code we can change find and replace a string by using the null script Thank you.